Okay, so good day po ulit sa ating lahat. So we're now going to focus our discussion all about divisions of polynomial. The long method. So kung naalala nyo yung pag-divide natin, nung, uh, when you are in your elementary grade, tinuruan po tayo. Say for example, uh, given this kind of division, 369 divided by 3. First thing to consider is yung unang number. Hindi yung 1 sa, kundi yung pinakaunang number to the left. I-divide mo siya. 3 divided by 3 is 1. 1 times 3, we have 3. And then subtract. This is cancelled out, so 0 na siya. Bring down 6. 6 divided by 3, we have 2. 2 times 3, this is a multiplication, so we have 6. Subtract ulit, so wala na rin. 0. Bring down 9. 9 divided by 3, so we have 3. And then, 3 times 3, we do have 9. Subtract ulit natin siya to so 0. So, the answer or the quotient is 123. Ganun din po ang gagawin natin dito sa ating long division. Okay. Ganyan po yung itsura niya. Function of x is equals to 2x cubed minus 3x squared minus 5x minus 12 sorry 12 and then divided by x minus 3 yan ko po ang klase ng division na gagawin natin but sinulat ko na po siya kanina pa na ganito yung itsura niya and we are going to have it in a long method division division of polynomials long method. Okay? So, first thing. 2x cubed minus 3x squared minus 5x minus 12 divided by x minus 3. Ang kailangan po natin bigyan ng pansin dito is yung first term. Tulad nung ginawa natin doon sa usual division natin. Okay? Yung first term. And then dito din, yung first term din natin dito. So, yun ang bibigyan natin ng pansin. 2x cubed divided by x. Okay? So, exponent, and then exponent nito ay 1, bawasan mo lang po siya ng isa. Parang kukopihin mo ito, bawasan mo ng isa. Okay? So, we have 2x squared. Then, multiply na po natin. 2x squared times x, the answer is 2x cubed. 2x squared times negative 3, the answer is negative 6x squared. Okay, and then, subtraction po tayo. Subtraction. So, this is cancelled out. Ngayon, since this is negative and negative at subtract, uh, subtraction po tayo, change the sign of the subtrahend and proceed to addition. Then, the answer is... 3x squared. Bring down 5x. Tulad nung ginawa natin dito kanina, eto lang po. 3x squared divided by x. So we have, bawasan natin ng isang exponent. So we have 3x squared po yun, minus 1, so x na lang siya. So 3x times x, so we have 3x squared. 3x times negative 3, so we have negative 9x. Then, we have subtraction po ulit. Cancelled out na yun. Change the sign and proceed to addition. So, we have positive 4x. Bring down negative 12. So, again, ito po yung bigyan natin ng pansin. 4x divided by x is we have positive 4. 4 times x is we have 4x. Then, 4 times negative 3 is that we have negative 12. Subtract po natin sila, cancelled out, cancelled out. So, wala po tayong remainder. At ang naging sagot po natin is 2x squared plus 3x plus 4.
para mas maintindihan nyo pong mabuti, kindly ulitin po ninyo ang video na ito, panoorin ninyo ulit. Okay, tandaan nyo mabuti itong binigay ko sa inyo na problem, kasi ito din po ang gagamitin kong problem sa next topic po natin. Okay, still, division pa rin po yun. Again, ulitin ko, o, oh, bibidyo ko ng mayos ha. Function of x is equals 2x cubed minus 3x squared minus 5x minus 12 divided by x minus 3. Okay, so again, panoorin nyo po hanggang sa maintindihan nyo po ng mabuti. This division of polynomials, long method. Thank you and God bless. Okay, Panoorin niyo po yung mga previous videos natin para mas maintindihan niyo po yung mga preceding uh, discussions po natin. Okay? Thank you. Bye.